properly in the soup in Melbourne are the old trams. The last one has just been ferried across the harbour and today fast, streamlined, double-decker, triple-sprung buses on their journey to Sydney roll across the spit. Narrow neck of land and not what you might have thought it was. Melbourne, in spite of the rival claims of Sydney, boasts the best buses in the world and, well, they certainly might be a downside worse. But spare a tender memory and a salt tear for the grand old museum piece of rugged pioneering days. The daredevil driver goes all out. Watch that curve, Digger. Gosh, that was a near thing. You may give the old trams the cold shoulder, but what about the warm leg? As we think we said, what about the warm... Today, the once busy steel cables lie slack in the engine house. The old cable trams rust in the yards. Some of the veterans have become park shelters, playgrounds for a generation that'll never know the thrill of a rip-roaring ride on an old iron shop. It might have been slow, but it was great fun. Today, hello there, we're moving. Goodbye, folks. So sorry, next Monday. My goodness, it's raining. That's torn it. Bungo!